Hello, thanks for today. Today we're gonna discuss how to make Halo 6 multiplayer amazing. How three four three can make Halo 6 multiplayer good, not like the trashy Halo 4 multiplayer. Sorry for your Halo 4 fans out there. And uh, yeah, Halo 5 I like better than Halo 4 personally. But anyways, we're gonna focus on Halo 6. So um, the main thing I want to like like push is like don't make the uh, BR overpowered. Because if you look at the H Halo 2 anniversary multiplayer and um, you know, all those different multiplayers uh, in the Master Chief Collection with the new updates. They seem to make be making the BR really powerful at a long range, which seems to not be doing people any damage. So, uh, so yeah, that's that. Um, also, I'd like to recommend bringing back Halo 3 mechanics. Like, in this game, it's just way too easy to snipe, in my opinion. Um, again, that's my opinion. I think, I mean, I've been raised with uh, playing Halo since Halo 1. And each game, progressively, with 343, has been easier and easier to snipe. So, yeah, like, you almost miss that, like that, just like that, not that hard. Anyways, um, just like that. It's not even that hard. Alright, I'm gonna kill this guy real quick. Alright, he had a shotgun. Okay, another another thing that I think would make Halo 6 multiplayer good again was, uh, is to make sure you don't add any more Spartan abilities. Like, I'm fine with the ones that they have now in Halo 5. I actually think they add a cool aspect to the game. But, uh, if they want to add more, I think they should... Uh, definitely consider not doing it as it'll make the game too much complicated for more people too complicated for most people to play and it won't be fun if they add any more elements to spartan abilities another thing that i, I recommend like them doing is to, to avoid timers for weapons because personally in my opinion with the timers for the weapons it doesn't add any skill base like if in like halo 3 um mlg and stuff people memorize the times for all those uh times for all the weapons to spawn which i thought uh, made a difference in between who was good and who was really good. Um, you can get to the weapons fastest, um, you deserve them, so. Memorizing the times is good, and knowing when to pick them up and stuff was always really good. Always a good plus, and I really think they should bring that back, is to add timers. Um, I also think they should do larger maps for, for, for uh, 4v4s. I think some of the maps in Halo 5, relatively small for a 4, 4x4, for 4v4s, you need to uh, take each other on, so. Yeah, just like that, it's pretty easy to snipe. Um, also, I'd recommend uh, they keep up the good work with the multiple, like the multiple choices in the play of the playlist. Um, Halo Five, the Three Four Three's done a way better job in Halo Five than Halo Four when it comes to playlist options. They add new ones and such, and uh, try to kill some people real quick. Let's see if I was anywhere around here. Yeah, this is really easy. Okay, um... Just like that. Anyways, another thing that I believe would at make Halo, Halo 6 multiplayer better than Halo 5 is to uh, bring back an actual rank system. So, like, uh, I feel like this game, if you're in the top 250, that doesn't mean you're actually good. Um, I've, I've placed, placed plenty of top 250 players, and they are not that good. They just, they just have that rank because they have time, and they, have, they don't have a life, so they just... Play Halo a lot, and uh, yeah, that's how they got their. Oh, well, I'm top 250 in the world, so I think they should bring back the ranking system because that was back when people enjoyed the Halos. Um, and I think uh, it basically represented your skill better, is what I'm trying to get to. So, um, definitely recommend bringing back the old ranking system. Like, actually, don't do this Onyx and Diamond crap. I do appreciate that they actually have a skill base in that. Um, typically, if you're in the uh, Onyx range, you're going to be better than people in gold or bronze, for, ex for example, and silver and all that. Like, I, I, that, that, that's what, a good way to separate the ranks. I don't know how I missed those. Um, but I really believe they should bring this back because this will um, bring more of the competitive Halo players back. Because um, I don't know, it just seems like. Uh, we lost that charm of it being a more of an MLG, MLG game. So I think we should bring that back for Halo 6 multiplayer. Anyways, uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and I will definitely respond back. Uh, I'm curious what you guys think. I'm sure if you're a classic Halo fan like me, you'll uh, you'll enjoy some enjoy and agree with most of the opinions that I made today. If you are a new Halo player that just started playing Halo, like in Halo 4 or Halo 5, you might be pissed at me, but frankly, uh, I really don't care, because I, yeah, you just need to play the old games. Those are the good days. Um, and anybody that's watching this would definitely agree with that. You 
play gold halos. So I do, I do have to say though, 343 industry definitely improved on the uh, aspect of multiplayer though from Halo 4. So definitely want to give them, give them kudos on that, and give them credit for that. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, like I said, leave a comment and please subscribe, and I'll be making more videos for you guys.